How did it come to be that Roger and On came together? We saw him posting from Paris on his Insta account in On Shoes. And they said, wow, Roger now, and that he's not working with another company anymore. He seems to be a big fan of On. And uh, some of our friends in Switzerland noticed as well. And Switzerland is a small place. So they said, hey, you should have dinner together. And uh, this we did. So um, we met in, in Zurich in a little restaurant. Roger came in with his baseball cap deeply into his face. He brought a friend as well. And we talked about, of course, sports, about innovation, about technology, because Roger has a lot of history in, especially in shoe development, but also apparel. So we felt there's a connection and he extended a challenge to us and said, Hey, could you bring your unique patented cloud tech to tennis shoes as well? So we met again two months later and we showed him an outsole. We had a printed outsole that brought cloud tech in a hidden form factor into a tennis shoe. Two years later, he was actually doing his comeback in Wimbledon in the Roger Pro that had this, this, this sole. And can I ask, how did he come to be a shareholder? Or Roger said, hey, I would love to get involved. That Hey, that's fantastic. But you know... You know, something like a classic sports star endorsement, us giving money to you, that's not, that's not really on style because we've always been growing out of the community and, and that's not in our playbook. But how about not us giving you money, but you giving us money and becoming a co-investor and a co-entrepreneur together with us? And to our surprise, Roger said, yes, that's what I'm going to do. He now probably spends 30 days, 30 to 40 days per year with us here in OnLabs, working on products. 